My name is Martin Entz. I'm an agronomist at the University of Manitoba. We're at Carmen, Manitoba at our organic farm. And uh, I'm standing in, in the middle of an experiment where uh, one of the students, Carolyn, is looking at different uh, plant combinations to create mulches. So what we're looking at here is uh, uh, various plants either grown by themselves or in combination, things like barley, peas, hairy veg, sunflower, uh, oilseed radish. Um, and what we'll do is when the barley flowers, we'll roll these plots and then study how the different uh, plant combinations create mulch and what is the uh, decomposition, what are the decomposition characteristics of those mulches because of course we want to create a mulch that's going to be around for and suppressing weeds for a long time. Here in this particular plot we have a mulch, uh, a plant community which includes barley and peas. This is the 4010 forage pea and it also includes sunflower right here and um, oilseed radish which is right here. So there's the radish. Um, so it's uh, it's interesting to, to look at a, a large community of plants because the, uh, the diversity should give us more biomass production. Um, but uh, we'll be interested in how the plants form once they're blade rolled. Um, what, what type of mulch they'll form and how durable that mulch will actually be. Other combinations include barley, hairy vetch, peas, sunflower, um, um, barley, pea, barley, oilseed, radish, pea, etc. All the combinations.